Catastrophic flooding impacted large parts of eastern Kentucky. Lexington Christian Academy stepped in to action to support the community of Lost Creek in Breathitt County. Joining us now with more on how LCA is continuing the support this holiday season is Leslie Sizemore Harden. Thanks good for being morning. on the show again. Oh, good, good morning. morning. It's a pleasure to be back. Yeah. Um, so tell us a, l a little bit more about the LCA partnership with Breathitt County. So this is a partnership that we've been working on for a number of months. It started back when the floods occurred. Um, our football team visited with their football team to help just love on them and to clean out their locker room, their trophies, their uniforms. So that was the start. But then we realized, well, that's not all that we can do. We can do more. And so a couple of weeks later, we gathered uh, back to school clothing and school supplies and we took them down so that the students would have new items to start the school year. And then we said, we need to do more. And so we visited again and we provided them with Thanksgiving baskets just a couple of weeks ago, along with books um, for students to enjoy over the holidays. And then a couple of days from now, we're gonna go and visit for Christmas. Oh, it's oh, yeah. fantastic. You all just continue to give. Tell folks at home what, what, what it was like seeing some of the damage in that area after the floods. It was, it was overwhelming. Um, you know, you saw homes that had been physically moved by the waters. You saw um, cars that were in great disrepair. And um, it was humbling seeing even the schools. When we were down there in uh, August, we, we still saw some of the damage then. And it, it made us uh, just desire to help even more uh, because we saw the tangible need and just how families, even back in the, the fall, who, who weren't able to get back in their homes. And so we wanted to do everything we could to provide encouragement and support. And, and you're continuing to do that. One of the things that I love is that it's not just a one-time occurrence, yes. right? You're yes. hoping that this partnership expands as, for as long as they need it. Almost definitely. Um, the phrase we've been saying, we're not one and done, and we are looking to just continue to pour into them. Uh, we, we've even bestowed uh, love baskets to their administrators so that the teachers and principals could have treats and encouragements as well because we know, especially coming out of the pandemic, it's been hard on our teachers. And so we want to love and bless their administrators, their teachers, their families, everything that we can to just encourage them. Oh, that is awesome. And they need, they need every little bit they can yeah. get. You know, yeah. that's the thing, all of them do. We appreciate you so much. Thank you so much.